points of access with civil points. Showing you how to improve access to your digital world. In Adobe Acrobat Pro DC, when you want to take a large file and break it up into smaller files, you just open the file. And then you want to have it on pages view, so you're going to click on the left arrow on the side. And up here there's an icon that says thumbnail pages, basically. And you click that, and it shows you the book in its entirety, page by page. And so when you're first looking at a book, you want to find the early material of the book, including the table contents and so forth, and the title pages and all that, and save that off as a front matter. You can include the preface. And so I'm going to come down here and find the first logical break. And this appears to be actually where the first chapter begins. So basically, I'm going to come to the last page of that first section and call it Front Matter. And so I basically come to that page, right click on it, and click Extract Pages. Now it's set to take only that one page, so I have to type one and then it has the two range to 22. Then what I want to do is delete the pages after extracting and not extract pages as separate files. I click OK and then I click Yes. And so this first chunk of the book is the set of pages we just took. So we have to save them. So I click on File, Save As. I want to find the folder that I have set up for the sample book. So I'm going to open that folder. And you can see the entire documents right there. But this is just going to be front matter of sample book. And so I then close that window and I come back and I'll scroll down to chapter two. Sometimes they come up rather quickly. You have to be careful not to get too many chapters at once. So this would be this section again. And one more time, you come to the last page of the section you want, you click on it, then you right click, click extract pages, type in one in the first box here where it says from, and it will select up to the page that you clicked on, and click delete pages after extracting, click yes, and then you're going to save that chunk file save as. And so I already have the location set here as it shows in the save and recent folder. I click on that and then I type chapter one of sample book. So it's important that you break the book up into smaller chunks being that these PDF files are actually a picture of the book. And as I've shown you in another video, to demonstrate <coughs> that it's a picture, you can come down to the text and you see that you cannot actually highlight any of the words of the text. And you can also come over here to tabs and you can see there's no tags available. So the book isn't marked up and it's not accessible at all. So the next step after 
breaking the book up into sufficient smaller chunks is to then convert it using OCR.